I am a sheep farmer in West Stirlingshire and I have aspired all my life to be a farmer. And I only got the opportunity to become a farmer when I retired from teaching. I didn't expect to end up with 400 acres and I've grown my flock from the original 10 gimmers up to 370 breeding ewes. When FAS support was made available, it seemed the obvious thing to do to apply for support because I've always gone for opportunities to learn things and I've always found that my farm business benefits from taking support which is offered. The help I got from the advisor for the biodiversity application was, it, it was really, really good. She spent a lot of time walking around the farm with me and looking at the areas where we could encourage broader biodiversity um, and then signposting me to where I could buy, um, for instance, uh, seed that had a provenance in Scotland um, and what these seeds would do uh, and how to manage these seeds to make the whole thing sustainable and continuous. There's no doubt that biodiversity helps in a long-term sustainable way when you think about the challenges for bees, for instance, and other pollinators on the farm. I certainly would recommend FAS to other farmers. Um, for me, and probably for them, it helped me to focus at a time when farming is going through enormous challenges. You need to be able to benchmark where you started from to have a really good analysing of our farm businesses to see where we are and what opportunities there will be in the future.